8.54 p.m. GMT Associated Press Johns Creek, Gar. Lizette Salas relied on precision and big putts to make up for a big power gap against Nelly Corder, and they wound up tied for the lead Saturday going into the final round of the KPMG Women's PGA Championship. Salas was practically flawless in delivering a 30 on the front nine to go from a one-shot deficit to a two-shot lead. She then made her first bogey of the week after 45 holes and didn't make another birdie in a third straight five under 67. Corder, the 22-year-old coming off a victory last week on the LPGA Tour, played bogey-free but failed to use her length to capitalize on the par fives on the back nine of Atlanta Athletic Club. She had a 68. They were at 15 under 201, five shots clear of a trio that includes Patti Tavartanakit, the Thai star who won the first LPGA major of the year at the Anna Inspiration. Tavartanakit ran off four straight birdies toward the end of her round for a 65. Joining her five shots behind were Giulia Molinaro of Italy, 66, and Francis Celine Boutier, who had a 69 while playing in the final group with the co-leaders. Boutier had reason to think she was out of the tournament when she fell nine shots behind as the group was approaching the turn. She was playing fine. It's just that Salas was playing out of this world, and Corda was not too far behind. Salas, who began the week by sharing her emotional struggles of coping with the COVID-19 pandemic, began her round by holing a 45-foot putt across the green. After a wedge to three feet for a birdie on the par five second, she drained a 35-foot birdie putt on no. 3. That was set up by another fairway metal. Corda was constantly some 35 yards beyond her off the tee, hitting short irons when Salas was hitting hybrids and fairway metals. It's a wonder her caddy, John Killeen, didn't lose any head covers. No matter. The 31-year-old Californian couldn't miss. She brought a US Open game, fairways and greens, nothing fancy, to the women's PGA and it worked. Salas took the lead for the first time with a 5 hybrid to 25 feet and another long birdie putt on the par 3 7th, and she hit a 4 hybrid to 12 feet into no. 8, a hole that yielded only 8 birdies the entire round. But after 45 holes without a bogey to start this major, Salas caught a tough lie on the edge of a fairway bunker left of the 10th, the ball above her feet as she tried to find balance on either a slope or in the sand. She played short, hit a weak wedge and two putted from 25 feet. Corda caught her with a birdie on the 13th, and they both made pars coming in. Both will be seeking their first major on Sunday and will be in the final twosome. Salas has only one LPGA Tour victory seven years ago. Corda is a rising star, the younger sister of Jessica Corda and the daughter of former Australian Open tennis champion Petter Corda. She already has five wins and is no. Three in the world, the highest ranked American.